Hospitals are feeling the strain of community spread, but it's not just the bed space. Kansas Health Association surveyed hospitals in 11 counties around Kansas City. Half of the 32 hospitals that responded said they anticipate a, quote, critical staffing shortage this week. The percentage of available beds right now among those hospitals is 19 percent. And those hospitals around Kansas City aren't just dealing with the spread of COVID-19 in the metro. 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plake talked to local doctors who are trying to manage a surge in patients. The need for hospital beds in Kansas City is going higher and higher as doctors predicted. Not only are they caring for patients here, but they're also seeing more people from rural areas coming in for treatment. Hospitals in Kansas City are receiving more COVID patients from outside the metro. There are not enough resources to take care of critically ill patients and these small community access hospitals are critical access hospitals and that does require transfer to higher level of care including our St. Luke's entities. We recently have had some patients from further out of town but it's more a bed space and a staffing issue. It's not rural health care access. It's just everyone is stressed right now. Doctors say the need for ICU and inpatient beds is surging. In Hayes, though, uh, they do have 30 patients, 27 active, and three in that recovery period, too. So it is taking up a large proportion of their hospital beds. Nurses at the University of Kansas Health System are turning other parts of the hospital into ICUs to make space. You know, open up alternative care areas, take some of our post anesthesia recovery areas and turn them into hospital beds for patients to be in the beings. We just don't have enough beds. We talked to Pascaline Mahindra, who is a registered nurse at Research Medical Center, who noticed the demographics on her floor are changing. In like smaller towns in Missouri as well, like we're seeing those patients as well, which uh, typically is not uh, the kind of uh, patients that we see at research. She wants the public to know that nurses are now caring for more than two patients at a time, which she says is dangerous and not what nurses feel comfortable with. Um, you definitely have to wonder um, if the uh, governor of Missouri would have uh, mandated a mask, uh, like a mask mandate, um, if that would have changed um, the amount of cases that we're seeing right now. Sarah Plake, 41 Action News.